The two-time world champion, Fernando Alonso, finally found considerable success with the Aston Martin in this season, after driving uncompetitive cars over several seasons. Now he stood on the third consecutive podium of the season, proving that he is an unstoppable beast in a competitive car, despite he is the oldest in the grid. Few years ago, he left the sport after an unsuccessful second stint with McLaren, and no one ever thought that he will return to sport. Surprisingly, he made a comeback with Alpine two years later and showed his interest to win his third title than competing for money. He felt that Alpine is far away from a winning path and made his switch to British racing colors as the replacement of Vettel. But this video is not to discuss his achievement as a Formula One driver, and this is something about his personal life. Even though Alonso found success in this season as an athlete, he failed again as a person with the sudden parted away with his girlfriend, Andrea Schlager. Through this video, we are going to discuss deeply about this sudden announcement made by the Spaniard after his podium finish at Albert Park. Before we proceed, hit the subscribe button and smash the bell icon for more exciting updates. For the first time, Alonso gave an update about his relationship with Andrea by posting a photo of himself and Schlager on his Instagram with a caption that read, We wanted to tell you that our relationship as a couple ended. We have been lucky enough to share a fantastic time together, and it will continue to be so, but on a different form of affection. As you have probably seen, we have continued working on and off track on various projects together also during this time, and we will keep doing so with deep love and respect for each other. We thought it is appropriate to share this as you have all been very supportive. Thanks for that. Love Fair and Andrea. Alonso met Andrea Schlager for the first time at the Formula One paddock as a TV presenter. In addition to her role as a TV presenter, Andrea is working as the brand ambassador for the sports car brand Cupra as well. For the first time, they appeared together at the 2022 Miami Grand Prix, and since then, the couple had seen together regularly in the F1 paddock and many events. But only very little is known about Alonso's relationship with Andrea Schlager, and both kept it out of the public eye as much as possible. This year, Miami Grand Prix is scheduled to be held on the 8th of May, and their relationship came to an end even lesser than one year. However, both cannot move away from Formula One, as their professions are attached directly to this sport. So, they hope to continue work together on various projects with love and respect for each other. This is not the first time that he failed in a relationship, and the 41 years old Formula One driver is still without children from any of the previous relationships. When the media questioned about his reason to have life free of relationships, he said that his dedication to the sport left him with no friends, no family, no free time, no privacy, no wife, and no kids. But this statement doesn't reflect what he actually did in past as Alonso had a collection of affairs throughout his entire F1 career. He can be described as a playboy than a dedicated lover who failed in a relationship. His Formula One career began in 2001, and since then he had a bunch of relationships in his known history as a driver in the premium racing category of the motorsport. First, he had a relationship with a girl called Rebecca for more than five years since 1999. But it came to end one year before becoming a world champion and started dating a model called Carolina Costa. But it wasn't a successful relationship and came to an end within one year. There were some infamous rumors about his short-term relationship with girls like Jenny Kessler and Fliss Jane in 2005, as he had a huge attraction of girls as a young Formula One driver. Then he met Raquel Del Rosario during a radio interview and married her secretly in 2006. But very little was known about this affair until it is revealed in 2008. One year later, rumors were spread about his potential affair with Zenia Chumicheva, and this became the cause to announce the divorce with Rosario. Alonso didn't want to continue the relationship with Xenia beyond 2011. He arrived the 2012 German Grand Prix in Hoffenheim with a supermodel called Dasha Capustina. This relationship became more public than his previous affairs, and the couple became a more regular appearance in the paddock throughout the 2012 season. However, that relationship also had no life of more than two years, and Alonso parted away from Dasha in 2014. Lara Alvarez is another name that can be found in Alonso's long list of ex-girlfriends. 
It is said that Alvarez was with two-time world champion from December 2014 to March 2016. Then, he had a short-term affair with another model called Vicky Odintkova in 2016. But Vicky also dated the main rival and old teammate of Alonso, Lewis Hamilton, too. But Alonso stayed a brief period with Odintkova and immediately turned towards an Italian model and TV presenter, Linda Morselli, who was famous as an ex-girlfriend of MotoGP champion Valentino Rossi as well. Even though this relationship was not a more public one, it long lived than any of Alonso's other relationships. They spent a very close and happy life together until it came to an end in 2021. He spent one year without any famous relationship before making the announcement about Andrea Schlager. Now you know who is Alonso and what he did in past. It is difficult to predict that he is going to stay without any relationship when examining about his personal history. The 41 years old will surely go to a new affair sooner or already with an affair. But Alonso always stops at the limit of a girlfriend and never fools to end up in a marriage. So he has the full freedom of switching between girlfriends thanks to that genius decision. Now Alonso fans are waiting to see the new hot flame of the two-time world champion as he had a very hot ex-girlfriend collection throughout his entire career, despite the label, oldest in the grid. Do you have any rumors to share with us about the new girlfriend of Alonso? Use the comment section below. We really love to hear something from Alonso fans. Thank you very much for watching the video. If you enjoyed the video, subscribe the channel to get more exciting Formula One news. See you guys in the next video. Goodbye.